Hey, what's up, y'all? Silent Alonzo here. Just want to talk about some dog along Mars. And the first thing that I have, because I have forgotten to mention this on the past couple videos, but there is an active proposal on the dog along Dow to fund a Twitter bot that actually notifies us of big transactions on uh, Elon and anything dog along Martians NFT related. So if you want to go ahead and vote on this DAO, I'm going to place the link in the description so you could go check that out. It's going to have all the details there. So um, make sure to check that out because you can make your voice stand out and be heard in this matter. So the more votes we get, the better off it is, right? So um, the next thing I want to talk about is that the Dogalon Warriors have released another comic. Can you believe we are already on number 14? This is this is a, amazing. I mean, just how much time has passed and, and just the creativity that continues to go on and how the community continues to create uh, uh, support each other and trend. This is this is amazing, and the artwork the artwork is just astounding. I mean, if you haven't seen it, go check it out. It is on Open Sea, and uh, if you go to the Dogalon Warriors Twitter page, you can definitely see it there. So it is a, a really really a sight to see. So once again, I mean, we're looking at these markets. I know yesterday we were talking about that it could potentially. Uh, uh, dip some more, and uh, it looks like Dog Along Mars is actually, you know, staying uh, pretty level. Um, you know, consider all things considered, right? But um, you know, I've had a few comments and uh, um, people uh, saying that they believe that BTC is going to go a whole lot lower. I've had a few phone calls. A few of my uh, close friends tell me that, man, you know, considering the recession and this and that. And uh, um, like I like I've said, you know, um, what if it doesn't go down and this is our last opportunity to get in, you know, uh, that's why I can, that that line of thought is what keeps me purchasing at these prices, because, um, you know, what if what if it doesn't go any lower, you know, and if it does, I, you know, you could always buy more. So, um, you know, my question to you guys is. How low do you think BTC is going to go? And is this it? Because uh, uh, I'd rather have a consensus. All of us look at different charts. All of us, you know, have different different opinions and we form them in, in different ways. So if you'd be so kind to comment and tell me what level you think BTC is going to go, um, you know, I'd really appreciate that because regardless, hey, in the future, I don't know how close it's going to be, how near it is, or how far it is, but I know things will go up. So I feel confident in making my purchases uh, with no problem, but I do want to be prepared. I do want to have a Hail Mary order that does reach low enough uh, to capture uh, the best prices that I can possibly get. So, um, you know, with that said, you know, there's still there's still momentum in the background. Like we said, uh, the uh, Coinbase has added us to uh, Coinbase custody, which is an excellent thing. Um, you know, we have the Dog Alon Dow proposal that we were just discussing. And, uh, you know, everything still rings true, man. You know, 50% of the liquidity is still locked in Uniswap. You know, um, the uh, uh, International Space Station did tweet us out and thank us by name dog on mars and um you know you have the methuselah foundation which is the the biggest holder and a steward of the token that is committed to the growth of the token and uh, uh they have plenty of things going on in their organization as well um not to you know not to to uh, uh you know uh mention not to mention that we still have the opportunity to be listed on many other exchanges. And like I said yesterday, I don't think that it would be wise for us to list during these times. But uh, I believe, this is my belief, I believe that we are locked and loaded and ready 
to be listed on some of these exchanges. And I know, I know. I mean, I haven't seen um, what type of purchases are being made for Elon at these levels, but I imagine that a lot of people are loading up. And if they're not, they're waiting for the next dip. Because uh, what I'm hearing is that most people believe that there will be one more dip before we finally start moving to the upside. So um, if you have a moment, share your opinion with me. Uh, because we all want to get our hands on as much as we can at the best price possible. And uh, I think if together as a community we start trending um like we used to, right? And I still see everybody trending, but if we could get a more uh, uh, unified front on this, I think we could cover a lot of ground, man. I like uh, the thought of a meme contest. Who can create the best Doggle on Mars meme? I like, uh, um, you know, everybody sharing and everybody talking about it, creating videos and all of that. And uh, it makes up the community. So if you have a contribution, uh, uh, Post it, share it, journalism, whatever it is that it takes or whatever it is that you enjoy. And uh, I will be glad to share it on my Twitter. Just reach out to me and I'll get it done. So if you ain't got no dog along Mars, get you some. And if you've seen the official Get You Some merch, go to gmwys.com and get you some as well. Peace.